I'm going to run you through how to install Subjects Plus version 2. It should be easier now because we have an installer. Um, just a few steps. First, you need to get the files and uh, download them. You need to unzip them into uh, your web server or wherever you want to use them. Uh, you need to create a database and a user in MySQL. And then you need to point your browser at the control folder. And at that point, uh, you'll be in the installer and you should follow the instructions. So you can get the files in various places. Here we are at um, GitHub. So we can click on the zip, uh, download the repository's zip file, which I've already done. Um, so here we are on my, this is on my local machine. Here's the file. I will extract them all. And we wait a few seconds. And what we're going to do is we're going to end up with a file and we'll rename it to something uh, a little bit better. So there we are with the subjects plus master. Um, so I'm going to drag, I'm going to rename this. Uh, I'm going to drag it down so you can see what I'm doing. And I'm going to rename it subs plus. And I'm going to put it in the root of my web server on my local machine. And there's the subs plus. Um, so the next thing, so we've got our files in place, the next thing we want to do is we want to make the user and the database. So we will go to our browser where I have PHP my admin on another tab. I'll create a database called subs plus, which I don't believe I have already. And there it is. Um, <coughs> so I've got this and because it's in my local machine I've got a user called root with no password, which is very naughty. So the next thing I need to do is point my browser at um, that spot on my file system. I'll drag it down a bit so you can see. So I'm just going to local, host, and then subs plus, and then control. And I'm going to drag this up again. And it says, oh no, the configuration file is missing. Um, so let's make it. And basically it's going to say, you need this information, which we already have. So the username, because I'm naughty, is root, and there is no password because I'm extra naughty, and the database is called subs plus. And we'll click Save Config. And if something had gone wrong, we would have gotten an error message here, but we didn't. So now we run the installer. It's going to ask me some more questions, um, kind of basic stuff, which I'm not going to fill out. Uh, but you will want to, and you're going to want to change the email key to something that works for you. But I'll just leave that all blank for now, and install Subs Plus. We wait a second, and here we have, it's created the user for me. I'm admin at SP, so we'll log in, and it'll open a new tab. So, admin at SP, and we're going to try cutting it <coughs> and pasting. And it worked. Okay, so here we are. It's first time installation. We haven't really fleshed this out much, but um, give you a couple of recommendations. So I'm going to close this, and basically here we are. We're in, inside the admin. The one thing that you want to do, which that pop-up noted, is you're going to need to go into the config site right away. And because my screen's kind of small, it's showing it all as one big long column. Here's the stuff that we set up already, um, which you don't need to mess with, but um, and again, more of that. But there is some stuff below that you can configure. Um, you can set up what you want to show up for your staff table. We have some kind of customizations at the University of Miami that we use and you might not want to. You can name <coughs> what type of guides, how you want to call them. There's a bunch of stuff and you can click on the help to do this. But anyway, you should go through the screen and, um, and make sure you've got the um, the stuff you want in place and uh, you can always change it again later. So that's how to install it. It's live if I were to point to the um, <laughs> public folder which is slash subjects it'll show me there's nothing really there yet but um, it'll show me that it's actually up and running on the public side too. Alright, thank you very much.